Chapter 3 Episode 53 Battle Power Strengthening 1 How to Call a Strategy That Utilizes Money and Magic Power A Millionaire Play? Or Cheat Play? In an instant, it has changed Monogra's cityscape. A cityscape with strange designed buildings suddenly appeared in the forest, distorted by the cursed land effect, and piles of gold coins are everywhere. While looking at the site, an unusual combination of two people are walking around the city. Well, when the number of buildings increases at once, it even feels like we're in different city. That's because the selected built facilities are positioned randomly. One of them is Elder Mortar, and the other is Ira Takuto. Today, they are confirming the operational status of facilities which they had built and giving detailed instructions to the assigned citizens. Are they going to inspect the facilities after they are built? This question is in everyone's mind. The construction using the magic power is faster than everyone expected. Currently, a two is investigating the periphery of the city on a different matter. Takuto wanted to go along with her, but he could not be selfish in a situation where there is not enough time or manpower to begin with. Equals Eterpedia. Training Place, Building. Experience Value of New Production Unit, Plus 2. The training center is a facility necessary to create a national force. It can gain experience points when the player creates new units, allowing for quicker upgrades. Learning Facility, Building. National Magic Production plus 5%. National Crime Rate minus 5%. A learning facility is a facility that teaches academics to the people. Communicating national laws also has the effect of reducing crime rates. Living Reads, Building. Defense plus 10%. Additional Damage plus 1. Living Reads are a facility unique to Minogra and are an alternative to stone walls. In addition to the normal ability, it has the effect of dealing plus one damage to enemy units when defending the city. Training Place, Learning Facility, Living Reads These are newly created facilities in addition to the market. All the buildings that can be built at present have already been completed by emergency production and already in operation. Currently, the gold coins are still plenty. Then why the construction progress stopped at this point? There is one reason for that. Any more than that, and we'll need to research new technologies. We'll stop here for now. Few things are limiting the cheat play that uses magical power obtained by exchange gold coins. Those things are research and technology. This limits the buildings that can be constructed using Minogra technology at present. Of course, there is no way to complete the research instantly. In short, the next facility would be difficult to build until some kind of technology is acquired. Is that so? Now that the housing structures has been completed, the personnel assigned as builders can now be assigned as researchers. Labor such as food production is also entrusted to the homunculus created by the king, so I wonder if the research will be faster. Yeah, the tech level is important. Gradually I'll leave the simple work to homunculus. Like other buildings, the houses and farmlands constructions have been completed. Because of these constructions' progress, the homunculus production, a race unique to Minogra, has also begun. Currently, the only work that can be left to them is food production. Since the number of dark elves is very limited, the existence of the homunculus is very helpful. Furthermore, since they are also educating children at the learning facility, it can be said that the foundation as a nation has as a nation has finally been completed. However, even after we created so many different buildings, is the gold still not running out? I hope no one will come up with unnecessary thoughts. As he walks down the road from the center of the city, Elder Mortal looks up at the gold coins piles. It is natural to be overwhelmed by the overflowing amount of gold coins. Elder Mortar is thinking about what will happen if this situation leaked to the outside world. Not only in the Eternal Nations world, but in this world, gold is also a precious resource. Many people willing to die for it. 
Ordinary thieves would probably die of exhaustion before reaching the city because of cursed land miasma. But they can't let the Holy Kingdom Qualia found out about this. Elder Mortar thought they should exchange all gold coins for magical power, but the current national scale cannot hold too much magic power due to some restrictions. The situation has become strange. In the land where the King of Ruin resides, there is a mountain of gold that is almost infinite. It's like a fairy tale, but when you actually see it, you can't help but be concerned. It's hard to be concerned when you actually see it, especially when you're the one who is protecting it. That's why increasing our strength is an urgent issue. Elder Mortar nods to his lord's words. By using the magical power, Takuto not only created the buildings. He also created elite units that the Minogra nation can proud of. Equals Eterpedia. Headhunting Bug, Combat Unit. Combat Power, 5. Movement Power, 2 Repulsion Evil. Anti-Human Combat, plus 20%. Fast Movement Speed Even on Bad Roads, and Eyes That Can Look Far Away. Its Sickle Hungers for Enemies' Heads. The bug that grew up became a threat that cannot be ignored now. Headhunting bugs are a combat unit unique to Minogra. In addition to his ability as a scout, it has a bonus for his race. It can be produced by unlocking that advanced hunting skill or upgrading an experienced long leg bug. Equals Eterpedia. Brain Eater, Medic Unit. Combat Power, 3. Movement Power, 1. Medic Evil. Battle versus humans plus 50%. Non-human treatment plus 50%. Human city security plus 50%. Human. 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 Brain Eater is a replacement unit for the medic in Minogra. As a basic ability, they can heal allies from the same group every turn. They also have a strong attachment to humans, so they have a big bonus against humans and their close relatives, the subhumans. However, to use them in Minogra, where there are no human species, a particular strategy is required. The operation difficulty is high. Equals Eterpedia. Giant Grass Flytrap, Combat Unit. Combat Power, 5. Movement Power, 0. Human Meat Eating Evil. Defense Bonus plus 25%. Asterisk This unit cannot attack. Once upon a time, there was a greedy grass that wished to eat the biggest flies. Now it specializes in eating people. Giant Grass Flytrap is a combat unit that specializes in defense. It can't move out of the city and can't attack by its own. Still, it can gain a higher bonus than usual depending on the city's defense capabilities. The maintenance cost is very low. Headhunting Bug X3 Units Long Leg Bug X28 Units Brain Eater X15 Units Giant Grass Flytrap X30 Units These are the defensive forces that are currently defending Minogra Capital. The general soldiers were still not being produced due to the need to maintain food supplies and lack of personnel. Still, the rest of the forces were in excessive numbers. At the very least, it would not be easy to defeat them if they were holed up in the cities and focus on defense. But how I should say it? I sense a strong will to destroy humans. Because it's more convenient to have racial special effects. While retrieving and looking at the notes in his pocket, Elder Mortar's face turned pale when checking those units' evil abilities. However, their unique characteristic is because of their setting as Minogra unit, so that is unavoidable. In any case, the current known potential enemies are the Holy Kingdom Qualia and the Elves Nation, LNAR Spiritual Alliance. If they were the enemy, then the abilities are perfect. However, that is not the end. This is because there is a big possibility that an unknown force like the Brave Quest's Demon King army will appear. But it's still not enough. You guys have an important job. This is more important when it comes to strength. You mean this? The old man smiled at Takuto's words. 
he took out a book from his pocket and showed it to Takuto. It was a crude book without a cover, a bundle of paper bound together with string, full of a handmade feel. But they both knew that the information in the book is far more valuable than its appearance. The kingdom of God is really wonderful. War and killing people can be so easy. Takuto created war textbooks using emergency production. Textbooks for beginners that extract and summarize the elements necessary for battle. It's a compilation from various books in ancient, modern, eastern, and western countries. The textbook's full of knowledge that if one learns the book's contents to the end, one can win the war no matter how uneducated he is. What was given to the elder mortar was a copy of the necessary information from a large number of books that Takuto and Atu took the trouble to summarize at night. But your majesty, so many advanced ideas that can be described as scary. Actually what is the kingdom of God? Well, it's a weird place. I don't know if it's comfortable to live in. Ha, huh, is that true? Takuto avoided Elder Mortar's question. Even though he could tell him about his original world, but Takuto decided not to reveal too much and explained his world as the kingdom of God. More than that, how is it? Can you remember? To a certain extent. Right now, I'm still discussing the difficult parts with Jia and Emol. However, because it is a completely unknown technology, I can't learn it overnight. It can't be helped for that area. Future technologies and ideas are complex and diverse. Even if it was suddenly handed over to Elder Mortar, it could not be used immediately. Besides, in this world where there is a concept of magic and a concept of racial traits, it is necessary to reconstruct after disassembling the elements again. However, that knowledge definitely will change Minogra. The bloodsheds and the number of corpses piled up are different. The grudges' voices of the dead talk to him through the book to give them company. Takuto continues to discuss with Elder Mortar without a two. What kind of emotions lies in his heart when answering Elder Mortar's questions? They can hear the sound of earth swaying. The sound became louder as they are approaching the training center. That is the sound of deathly technology that the world known as the Kingdom of God has acquired through many years by sacrificing countless lives. The gate of hell is quietly opening in search of new victims.